As the province's energy corporation, Nalcor Energy has a vision to build a strong economic future for successive generations of Newfoundlanders and Labradorians. As part of this vision, Nalcor is responsible for meeting the electricity needs of residents and businesses in the province. This includes securing sources of clean, renewable and affordable energy. Labrador's Lower Churchill River is home to two of the most attractive undeveloped hydroelectric sites in North America. They are key components of Newfoundland and Labrador's energy warehouse. As phase one of the Lower Churchill developments, Nalcor is proposing to construct an 824 megawatt hydroelectric facility at Muskrat Falls on the Lower Churchill River. The project will meet the province's electricity needs, facilitate further industrial growth, and lay the foundation for long-term energy exports. Nalcor's subsidiary, Newfoundland and Labrador Hydro, has determined the province will need new sources of electricity as early as 2015. There are several factors driving this need, including growing demand driven primarily by increased use of electric heat in homes and industrial demand on the island's nickel processing facility. The province also expects major industrial development to occur in Labrador in the coming years. To meet this growing need for electricity, Nalcor has examined a broad range of options, such as hydro developments, natural gas, wind, oil fire generation, and electricity imports. Following detailed screening and analysis, two feasible options were put forward. The interconnected island alternative features the development of Muskrat Falls and a transmission connection from Labrador to the island. The isolated island alternative continues to rely primarily on increased use of thermal generation, including the ongoing operation of the aging Holyrood Thermal Generating Station. Nalcor conducted an in-depth analysis to compare the cost of both alternatives. The results showed an economic preference for the interconnected island alternative, featuring the construction of Muskrat Falls. The same analysis showed that continuing the isolated island alternative would mean greater cost to electricity consumers over time. This is because under current conditions, electricity rates on the island of Newfoundland are directly influenced by the price of oil used to generate electricity at the Holyrood plant. Developing Muskrat Falls is the least cost option for consumers and through an interconnection to Labrador, the island will move from dependence on thermal generation to the use of clean, renewable and stable hydropower. With the development of Muskrat Falls and the Labrador Island Transmission Link, electricity generation in Newfoundland and Labrador will be 98% renewable and will give electricity consumers and businesses the benefit of rate stability for generations to come. An investment in Muskrat Falls today lays the foundation for the future prosperity of Newfoundland and Labrador.